everyone welcome back to my channel today i will be sharing my tips and tricks for homework i hope these help you but you do not have to necessarily use these tips make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel now let's get started my first tip is to check over what you have for homework this way you could do my next tip prioritizing prioritizing is pretty important in the homework realm how i prioritize is based on three categories which is which class it's for, when it's due, and how long it will take. Then I will start with the assignments due the next day. After that, I will study, and finally I will do long-term assignments. Alright, here's a trick. Whenever I get a textbook or required novel, I like to label the chapters so that it's easier to find what I'm looking for. Here's an example. Using post-it notes, I labeled the different sections like the prologue and stuff. You know what I mean. Trick that I use is not meant for everyone. If I want to annotate a book, I use different colors of highlighters. I honestly prefer that over writing in the book. That way, if I look at it in the future, I'll just see there's many different colors. <laughs> so, um... I use the Stablo Swing Cool highlighters from the Pastel Collection. These highlighters are amazing, have such pretty colors, look cute, and are very good quality, so I recommend that you check them out. Me, I work best taking breaks after finishing one assignment at a time. Like I could rest or whatever, and I'd be more determined to finish my homework. Of course, the breaks are not too long or else I would never finish. Just try to see what you would prefer to take It's not breaks. related to the homework material, but I make sure I clean my desk after doing my homework. I just feel cleaner and more organized. This fun fact can also save time so you get started on your homework first. Site that I use a whole lot is my study life. This is a great website to organize your homework and to keep track of your progress. It is also convenient since there's an app too that you can download on your phone. As you can see, you can have your own schedule, you can put tasks, aka homework assignments, and study revisions. Last tip is to always have water besides your workspace. You need everything that you need with you, especially the water. You do not want to be dehydrated in the middle of typing an essay. I try to drink water more often. I hope these eight tips and tricks help you. I offered to share since I've been doing my homework pretty productive recently. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. If I did not have a single subscriber, I would have given up on my first video. Each video, I'm learning and improving. Now my schedules were clear, I'll try to post every Sunday. Make sure to comment down below what you want to see next. I will see you guys in my next video.